Hi, and welcome to How to Glocom Agent and Supervisor Edition Explained video tutorial. Glocom Supervisor and Agent Editions were developed for use with call centers. While Agent Edition was designed to increase agent's productivity and efficiency, Supervisor Edition was developed to better monitor and manage agent activities. If you have used Glocom before, you will notice that the Supervisor Edition login screen looks same as Business and Office Edition screen. While agent login screen has extra fields where you can enter agent number, PIN, and select between callback or dynamic agent. Let's start with the agent edition of Glocom. Once logged in, above toolbar, you can see agent bar. By clicking on the agent bar, you have the option to log on as callback and dynamic agent, as well as the option to log off. When an agent wants to take a break, he or she would press the pause button. And based on the settings in PBX where it will give you the option to choose pause options. In our case, we can choose between bathroom and lunch break. Another unique feature in the agent edition of Glocom is the agent panel. The agent panel displays information about queues and agents that are relevant to the call center agent. You can sort the queues by different categories. For example, you can sort queues by name, by number of available agents, by the number of the agents on call or on break, or by the number of agents that are busy. You can search for a queue by clicking on a queue search icon and typing the name or number of the queue. Same applies to the agent search. Simply click on the agent search icon and start typing agent name or number. You can filter which agents or queues are to be displayed in the agent panel by clicking on the settings icon and under queue tab set which queues you want to be displayed. And under agents tab you can set which agents are to be displayed in the agent panel. Under Alerts tab, you can adjust when to receive alert. For example, you can set to receive an alert when a customer has been waiting longer than 15 minutes in a queue. Next, we will look at the Supervisor Edition of Glocom. The unique feature of Supervisor Edition is Supervisor Panel. Inside the Supervisor Panel, you can get access to all relevant call center information organized using the tabs. Inside the Queues tab, you can see which queue has most or least unanswered calls or which queue has a low service level. You are getting all information that you need so that you can better allocate agents and maximize productivity of a call center. To display all this information in a visually easier way to read, you would use Wallboard. Wallboard displays all queue information in real time. And you can adjust every field to change its color when it reaches set threshold. Simply click on Preferences and under the Threshold tab, set each threshold field to desired value. For example, if we set calls unanswered value to 5 and color to red, Wallboard will display calls unanswered in red as soon as there have been 5 or more unanswered calls. Under Agents tab, you can access a list of all logged in agents and agent relevant information, such as which agent is on the call and which one is on the break. To interact with an agent, simply click on an agent name and choose one of the available options. For example, listen in order to hear the current conversation. Choose log out in order to log out the agent. This will not cancel the call in case agent is currently talking with someone. Click on transfer to transfer the call to someone else. The chat button will open the chat module with the agent. Clicking on the pause will pause an agent. The next step grabs displays call center data in a visual form so that the supervisor can easily recognize patterns or trends. Agent Inbound Stats tab displays the agent statistics such as number of calls answered, total and average talk time, and all other relevant information needed by supervisors in order to make decisions about agents' performances and efficiency. Queue Calls tab displays all active calls from every queue in a call center. As a supervisor, you can choose to transfer or take any of the calls, as well as to listen to the call in progress. Inbound and outbound tabs display all external, incoming and outgoing calls from a call center. Supervisor can transfer inbound calls, and in addition to transfer, supervisor can also take, listen or hang up outbound calls. Last tab in supervisor panel displays call center alerts. For example, when service level drops below the certain threshold. Thank you for watching this video, and if you have more questions, be sure to visit Bicom Systems Wikimedia page.